Hello guys, I'm Folu Storms and welcome as we go behind the scenes with BET. Now today I'm going behind the scenes to check out the South African multi-award winning musician Busiswa as she stops over in Lagos to continue filming a part of her reality series. It's called Her Majesty Busiswa. I want to know what that process is like and I will know that you guys want to know that too. So let's go check it out. Take your time when you study me. I'm what you call an anomaly. That kind of honey that draws the boys into my circle of it's not your first time. You've visited a couple of times before, and I wonder, what are some of your favorite things about Lagos, about Nigeria? It's amazing. I mean, I think um, Niniola's always uh, trying to convince me to have the local food. <laughs> so that's always fun. I enjoy um, um, partying with Naira Mali because he's the president. So it's always fun to go out with him. Um, I love the boat rides because, you know, the breeze, the air. I think that's why everybody in Lagos has beautiful skin. The skin starts to feel refreshed and it, it really feels like, okay, you had a break. So I want to find out, and I'm sure people out there want to find out as well, has it changed your day-to-day -day life, having like a whole crew following you around? Well, having a crew follow you around is like heavy work, you know? And um, I think it takes um, effort from the crew as well as from ourselves um, to try and stay balanced. Um, but also to be authentic, you know, to, to be ourselves and to really give people a real, um, the realest look, the realest feel of what our world is like and what our everyday is like. <laughs> So Ashwin, what has it been like, this process of filming this reality show, moving about the place? What has that been like for you? I didn't actually think it takes this much to be part of a reality TV show, shooting every day, having to be in character all the time, be yourself basically every day, but on camera a bit more. Obviously, you're just also trying to stay true to yourself all the time, so it is also like a soul searching journey for me specifically as well. And it's great that I get to do it with such great people as well. <laughs> so much of how you get her looking and what you get her to do. And for you, what's kind of the takeaway from this show? Because as the season is kind of progressing, um, what do you think you, you've taken away the most from this experience? Um, what I've taken away a lot from this experience is um, just learning uh, our crew members, their real, real personalities, because now we have to be the, together 24 seven. And yet back at home, it's like we shoot and bye, peace. And then it's like the next day maybe, but it's always like four to five hours. But now we're always together, you know? So I've learned a lot in terms of um, there are different personalities and, you know, the shift from happy to sad to tired to all of those things. And uh, we're doing great. Like, I mean, we've been, we've been together for nine years now, so it's that long. What are some of the highlights? What are some of the, the things that you thought, oh, that's kind of cool, like that's a dope thing? The highlights, the highlights would be then, obviously the recognition. I don't have to introduce myself in the room. <laughs> The recognition um, that I do get, I don't have to introduce myself in the room, they know exactly what I'm doing. I think that's really one of the biggest things as well. And also, it's always a big flex, man, being able to be this close to like a, a queen like Busi. So, like, you know, it's a big flex. And being on a reality show is amazing, you know what I mean? Being with her, and um, it's something that um, a lot of people would love, and I'll never take away that, you know what I mean? Because she's a legend in the making, and I'm glad to be part of her story. So that is the biggest high right now to being in this reality show. You've been shooting with Busiswa in Lagos now for a few days, and I'm curious, what is that like for you? And what is it really like, really like shooting a reality show? Well, um, like the word said, reality, it's about letting out everything, you know, even to the things that people at home are not even seeing, you understand? So, and, you know, we, as a sound guy, it's actually put you in that position in, uh, at which your star becomes vulnerable in, you know, in your ears. And then for people who are going to be tuning in and they want to watch about Her Majesty, for you, what is, what is like the overarching message that you want people to walk away with, you know, when they, they come into your life and they see how things run and they see how it goes? Because your music already, I feel, has liberated so many people in so many different ways. So with opening yourself up even more, what do you really want people to walk away with when they catch this show? First, 
lastly, I'd like people to have a better understanding of the fact that it takes a lot to be a businesswoman and an artist um, and be independent. You know, I think people think you're just having a good time all the time because you're making people happy. And that's why it's, it's amazing when platforms like BET invest in, in black women. I want people to feel inspired. I want black girls to, to be motivated, um, but also to fully understand that it takes a village and it takes a lot of hard work work to do what I do. Yo, guys, so much goes down when talent connects, when the African continent connects, and that is just a glimpse from behind the scenes. So make sure that you catch Her Majesty Busiswa every Saturday at 6.30 p.m. West African time on BT Channel 129. So until I catch a wave coming your way again, I'm sending you all so much love and light. By storms, baby. Her Majesty Busiswa, Saturdays, 7:30 p.m. on BET Channel 129.